morning y'all, so I have not vlogged in a very long time, so I do apologise, but I just didn't really, well, <laughs> well, I nearly kind of, I kind of burped and also nearly kind of threw up to classy. Anyway, so I have not vlogged for quite a while, I think it's because I just never really felt like it, like, I don't know, but um, I kind of want to vlog a little bit more, so that's going to do it now. In fact, I actually kind of want to do like a vlogmas kind of thing, so hopefully that should be good, but uh, I'm not sure how these vlogs are going to go, whether they're going to be extremely boring or I don't know, but anyway, so right now I'm taking um, some salmon and mozzarella and avocado toast, so I've got some bread and some olive oil, got some bloomy going on there, and we can get on. Okay, so I've just, well I didn't just eat, I ate it quite a few hours ago and I just didn't vlog the rest of it, but I ate that salmon and um, avocado toast and it was actually really nice. Anyway, so I'm just eating a coffee right now, I just made some cookies, so I'm just eating some coffee and cookies and life's good. Hi y'all, so I abruptly ended that vlog yesterday. I didn't vlog for the rest of the night, but I was just so tired and so busy. In fact, I actually fell asleep at like just after tea, which I hate doing. Like, I just hate sleeping like when it's the evening and not night time. Like, you know, it's like naps where you feel so groggy afterwards and you just, I don't know, it's the feeling of what day is it, what is happening, and um, yeah, that's why I hate taking naps, but I was just so tired that I fell asleep, and for like an hour, and then I woke up and then edited um, until like one in the morning, so um, I was just very busy, so um, it's the next day now, and so I need to, I'm going to do it for a walk, and as you can see, all the lovely trains, oh my god. Don't you just love autumn or winter? Um, is it winter? Because we're in November now. Is it technically class as winter? Because I only heard this around about a few months ago. But uh, but apparently November is classed as autumn, which I never knew about. Like I've always thought November was like winter, but I don't know. Have I just been really dumb my entire life to really realise? that November is in autumn, but I don't know, did, did anybody else know that, or I don't know, am I just really dumb and can't really um, say months of the season? Anyway, so yes, I'm out for a walk now, um, I need to... Okay, well that recording ended abruptly because my camera ran out of footage, storage or something, so um, right now I'm trying to trod through this really muddy um, half so yeah so what was I going to say oh yeah um, I need to run a few errands right now so that's where I'm going um, if I don't die from slipping on this mud riddled path so well I just need to um, bang myself in the tree um, yeah so that's what I'm going to do I'm going to run some errands um, edit some more um, film some videos tonight I um, don't know what to film but I'm sure I'll think of something and yeah I'm just going to try and continue to tackle these trees as I try and run errands and wow don't I look so crusty like I'm not sure if it's my camera or not because this camera's kind of bad okay so I'm back from running errands so I just have to go get a bunch of parcel stuff because I need to mail a bunch of things so I had to go to the store to get a few parcel papers and boxes and things so nothing that interesting really <laughs> but yeah, I literally just clean my room today. Like, I literally like deep clean my room today. Like give it, give it like a spring clean, which doesn't happen very often to be honest. Like I'm not really the most cleanest of people. Well, I am clean, but I and I'm also tidy as well. But I'm just not the person who like gives rooms a spring clean like every two weeks. Like we're talking like I have not dusted these shelves for months. Like this is what we're kind of talking about. So. I did that today and yeah they look so good so I mean these shelves when I was cleaning this morning like they, this was literally riddled with dust like I had to keep washing the cloth out because there was that much dust in it so 
that's kind of embarrassing, but now it's all clean. So anyway, um, I'm going to continue to edit a video now. Um, yeah, the video which I'm editing is quite a long and intense video, so I'm going to try and see if I can get uploaded tonight, because I've already edited like, the majority of the video, so that's good. So I'm going to do that right now, and then, uh, yeah. Okay, so yes, I know I should be editing right now, but... I just, have, I just have this sudden urge to make these box brownies. So I bought this brownie in a box the other day and um, I just have this sudden urge to bake brownies. So I'm going to make brownies and cookies. So you know those like things we have, we have like cookie dough and like in the middle of the brownie. So I've got the box brownie and then I have some cookie dough here to put on. So um, yeah, watch me make a brownie. <laughs> no, because like why is the brownie batter always taste so good? Like... I swear, like, I feel like the brownie batter, like the raw mixture, always tastes better than the cooked brownie itself. Same with cookie dough as well, like, I would much rather have the raw cookie dough than the actual cookie itself. Like, I mean, it tastes so good. Okay, now you're all going to say something like, oh my god, you're going to get salmonella poisoning. Listen, I have ate cookie dough and brownie batter loads of times for years now and I have not once had food poisoning or salmonella salmonella or salmonella things so I think I am good. Not to say you should eat cookie dough brownie batter, like don't eat it. Don't eat a lot don't eat a lot of it, but maybe like a teaspoon or something would be good, but I wouldn't say eat a load of it, but it's not like it's gonna kill you by eating cookie dough and brownie batter. So, yeah, that's my um, take on that. But, yeah, I'm just doing a sturdy brownie mix right now, which we've already stirred. So, um, here's what it looks like. So, yeah, it looks really good. So, I'm going to put it on this um, baking tray right now, which I've had to fill with tinfoil because usually I have, like, parchment paper, but I kind of ran out of parchment paper, so I'm having to use tinfoil, which I hate doing because usually... Sometimes the food will stick to the tinfoil, so I might have to like, grease this thing, but anyway. Ta-da! So, I know the cookie dough looks like potatoes, but I'm going to have to roll them into a ball so I can, like, flatten out into the lovely goodness that is the cookie and brownie thing. But I'm going to put this in the oven now, and hopefully by the time 20 minutes has passed or something, it will look very good. Oh my god! So, I just took these out of the oven now, so they're on the rack thing ready to... Cool, but don't they look so good? Oh my god, I am literally salivating right now looking at this thing.